It is revealed, those who are told to wire this access complicate. Visit the receiver. This wiring part is used to bring the car supply. This part is used to bring the exit button. Pull this part, because the weapon will go into the back of the lock. This part is used to connect the lock. This is the RFP, and this part is used to set the unlocking delay time. The default unlocking time is 5 seconds, and you can change the settings according to your needs. This part is used to set the open mode. The default open mode is monitored. This terminal is used to connect the external wire. As you the wire on the wire, wrap the red wire on the wire, and connect it to the quality terminal, and connect the black wire to the negative terminal. This terminal is used to connect the access, access keypad. Next, we will show you how to wire each component. Firstly, this part is used to connect the exit button. We use the white and blue JSC2 indicators. Grab the white wire to connect to the M-O terminal of the exit button. And grab the blue wire connected to the COM terminal. Secondly, connect the magnetic and negative door to the receiver. Grab the red and black JSC2 indicator. Connect the red wire to the positive terminal of the magnetic door. And then, connect the black wire to the negative terminal. And the magnetic door in the field state of the receiver to MC. Finally, connect the power adapter to the receiver. And drive the power adapter to the outlet. Then, we will show you how to pair the capacitor with the receiver. Press the RF key on the receiver drums. And the indicator on each will flash green once. Then, press the button on the transmitter within 20 seconds. The LED on the receiver will flash green three times to indicate the parent transmitter. After you press the button on the transmitter, the magnetic lock will unlock the door. And when you press the exit button, the lock will unlock too. The button beeps twice to indicate unlock, beeps twice to indicate the lock is closed. As you hold the clear code, please press and hold the RFP for 8 seconds until the indicator changes from green to red. When you press the transmitter again, the lock will not unlock, which indicates that the code is clear successful. Thanks for your watching.